All right, so now that we got an idea of how to teleport control where a character goes, we've learned some different command blocks. The challenge now for you is to create a three-stop teleportation tour. And so what you're gonna do is you're gonna create a new code here, and I'm just gonna get you started, but I want you to create your own. So this is gonna require you to build out three pretty cool locations. And so I'm gonna call mine Coffee Chug Teleportation Tour. All right, and I'm gonna work on my builds here in just a little bit, and, and I'll show you my final thing here um, after this tutorial. But for you, you're gonna pick the challenges to create three locations in your Minecraft world, and we're gonna have your character teleport to them using your Python code. And so one of the things that we have not talked about yet in any of the previous videos is something that's very, very important. It is the use of comments. When you're writing code, especially as your programs start to get a little bit more extensive, it's important that you use comments so you know what's going on so you can make reference points later in terms of what you are doing. And the way that we do that is we use the pound key or the hashtag um, um, in your work. And when you do that, the Python will not read those words. So if I do the hashtag, and I just type in connect to Minecraft, this is just making a note that these lines that we've been doing for a long time um, are going to keep our characters or, and our programs running effectively. So we've been doing this right here, and so we're going to go ahead and, and do that again. So we're going to type in this import mcpy minecraft as minecraft mc is equal to minecraft dot minecraft dot create all right so I've got that now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a few more things I'm going to import time kind of like I did earlier up here and so I'm just going to add that block back in here we're going to import time all right and then I'm just going to add a comment block here now, just so you have an idea of what I'm doing. And this is going to set my X, my Y, and Z variables. So what I'm going to do is X is going to be equal to, let's say, 100. Y is going to be equal to 10. Z is going to be equal to 50. Okay, so that is creating my coordinates as you can see there in the code. I'm going to leave another comment here where I'm going to be changing the player's position. So now in this code, I'm going to be changing where my players are going. So I'm going to go MC player dot set tile position to X, Y, Z. So this is now going to move my character to that position. Okay. And then another comment here. I'm waiting 10 seconds. And I'm doing that by putting time to sleep for 10 seconds. And then I'm going to set my X, Y, and Z variables again. So X is going to be equal to 30, Y is going to be equal to 2, Z is going to be equal to, let's go 80. And then we're going to change that position. So I can actually just copy this again in the code, drop that down here, and now I should have my character move to two locations. So I didn't give you all three because I want you to be able to figure it out. But now when I go to run this, okay, let's see what happens. So I'm going to run the module. I'm going to save it and let's see what happens to my character. So you can see that I must be in the middle of a mountain and now I'm stuck in water and I fell through. So those coordinates are not going to work, are they? So I want to go back here. This is where it 
it helps if you build your three structures first and you can just get your coordinates and it makes it a lot easier. So let's go back and change this here. Let's make this 30. No, let's make this 20. And we'll make this 80. Now let's see what happens. See if I get a better spot. There we go, now I'm on ice. Right outside the mountain. Let me see where it takes me. Still fell in the water, didn't I? All right, so I'm gonna keep working on that. I'm gonna work on my three locations, but your challenge is to write your own code to give us a tour of your Minecraft world. Three locations of places that you've created, and then let's take a look and see what you've created. All right, guys, best of luck, and I look forward to seeing your teleportation tour.